Hello everyone. Today we're talking about the five most difficult achievements in Mech Arena. Which ones they are and why, you'll find out after the intro. As you all know, each mech in the game has achievements and an achievement path. By completing certain achievements, you earn points that advance you along the achievement path. Along the way, you'll receive rewards such as A-coins, credits, crates, and even blueprints for the respective mech. Additionally, the achievement paths contain two epic skins, the Blue Neo Scale, which you get early on, and the Gold Futurist, which you receive towards the end of each achievement path. For the latter, you need to complete between 80% and 90% of the achievements, which varies from mech to mech. Now that you're up to speed, Let's dive into the top five hardest achievements. Spot number five goes to Nomad. Nomad has an achievement called Relentless. The goal is to deal 31 million damage with the second part of its chain dash. This is incredibly time consuming. Sometimes there isn't a second mech nearby to dash into. Other times you get stuck on something or die before you can dash the second mech. You need a high tolerance for frustration to deliberately complete this achievement. Of course, it will eventually complete on its own, but it takes a long time. Spot number four goes to Surge. The achievement Field Commander is found with nearly every faster mech. The goal is to earn a certain number of controller awards. For one of these awards, you need to capture two control points. Per round, you can earn a maximum of five medals. Typically, you need to collect 450 medals, meaning you must capture 900 control points. However, with Surge, it's different. You need to earn a total of 1350 of these awards, which means capturing 2700 control points. I've been playing Surge for nearly two years, always using him in control point clash, and I'm only at 747 of these awards. Specifically, for Surge, this achievement is extremely nerve-wracking. Spot number three goes to Teng. Teng has a beautiful legendary skin in the achievement path called the Scrapyard Devil. Unfortunately, there's no way around the achievement called Weapon Master, where you need to get 450 kills with RPGs. And I'm not talking about the Voltaic RPG, but the classic RPG. This achievement is relatively easy early in the game, but beginners often don't focus on mech achievements. By the time mech achievements become a focus, you're too advanced for the RPG to deal any meaningful damage. Without the help of my clanmates, I probably wouldn't have completed this task by now. Spot number two goes to Gatecrasher. Gatecrasher has an achievement called Armory, where you need to get 900 assists with Rocket Mortar. Unfortunately, this is easier said than done. Either you get a direct kill with Rocket Mortar, or the gap between the damage you deal and the mech's destruction by a teammate is too large, and the assist isn't credited. The achievement isn't impossible, but due to these circumstances, it drags on forever. And it can be really frustrating. I needed a three-month break after completing the Gatecrasher achievements, so you can imagine how exhausting it was. Spot number one goes to Aegis. Aegis not only has the most beautiful skin in the entire game at the end of the achievement path, but also the worst task in the entire game. This task is called Undercover. The goal is to protect teammates from javelin or mortar fire 900 times with your dome shield. The first problem is that in the advanced game stages, mortar or javelin is rarely used making it difficult to even find the basic conditions to progress the mission. The second problem is that the situation must be perfect 900 times. You need a teammate or bot, you need to be perfectly positioned, and you need to know that they're being targeted by mortar or javelin. This situation is so rare that you'll likely be working on this achievement forever, unless you get external help. And believe me, you'll need it. So, my friends, those were the top five hardest achievements in Mech Arena. What do you think are the hardest achievements in the game? Let me know in the comments. See you in the next video and take care.